Hello everyone, I'd like to start off by saying that I'm a Marvel movie fan, but even I have to admit, the rules of pin particles in the MCU are inconsistent. In the first Ant-Man movie, Hank Pym says that his pin particles can change the distance between atoms. Then later in the movie, Hope explains that the pin particles don't actually affect an object's mass. Let's assume both of these premises are possible. That would mean that when an object shrinks, it would become more dense but at the same time, its actual weight wouldn't change. So can anyone explain to me how the hell Hank carries around a tank? And then Scott rides an ant throughout the movie. How the hell is an ant supposed to support a 180 pound guy? My second grievance with the rules of the pin particles are their ability to make matter go subatomic. When Scott goes subatomic, it implies that he's smaller than the size of an atom. But according to one of the previous rules, Pym particles can only change the distance between atoms, not the size of the atoms or the molecules themselves.